Hello and welcome back to another Let's Roll play of Dragon Age Inquisition. I am Theron, the Dalish Mage in uh, his new Warden Armor. He's got his new electrical staff. And uh, I feel much more powerful, actually. Let's kill this raid. <laughs> All my attacks are now electrical. A lot of it's based off what your staff is. Let's go through here. Misty Grove. So we have to come out on the other end. Where is it? I think it's right about here. We have to head that way. So we're going to head south, and this will take us... Uh, where will it take us? Beneath the mire, there's another beacon to light, and then hopefully we'll get to where the Evar are. Oh, I need to, to mark it now. So this is the way that we didn't take. This way over here. Grabbing the blood lotus. Lots of it. It grows very prolifically in this area. Light veil fire. Okay, so I have my veil fire back. Some kind of uh, undead. I think they're attacking someone. Oh, it's Avar Bowman. Who are they shooting at? corpse. I thought it was uh, Undead Bowman, but I guess not. Uh, and now they're attacking us, you son of a bitch. Why? Take electric Take electricity. Big mistake on your part. Fools. Because of that. That arrow really hurt. Now, what's in this dilapidated old home? Small chest. Firm morning star. Balanced pommel. Okay. Cleansing rune. Uh, inflicts bonus damage against red templars and darkspawn on each weapon strike. A sack right here. Some irons inside. And you know, there's a some kind of a pot. Dense one-handed haft. It's a schematic. How are our packs doing? Oh, uh, just over half. Oh. Starting to feel its weight again. Trying to rescue those taken from the Inquisition, the Avar. <laughs> Of the water, those will be here till our deaths fighting them, and we'll be joining them. And that's not what anyone wants. Ah, uh, it's in the water. Well, this is this one of the. I don't know where the, what this is. There's a banner there. It's on fire, the, the area. More of our bowmen. Not going to fall for that one again. Oh, that did an enormous amount of damage, actually. We may be able to go back to the hinterlands and close those last two fade rifts. We will have to go back at some point. 
I have no idea why places like this exist. Burning corpses. No, we're gonna go to Val Royale before we return to the it's, it's a given. Uh, one day I want to return to face a dragon. There's a red lyrium vein in there and an ocularum in that dragon valley. And I'd like to return and uh, heavy free armor. Heavy free army armor. Yeah, we'll return one day. There must be something here. Uh, there's an undead chasing us. That does it. Oh, there's a hut to the right. Go into the swamp. And there's a lot of undead around us. Okay, disengage, just get in here. That's my cell phone is now fully charged. Charge it while I do this. Cabin key required. Really? There's a... I'm hearing something inside this home. Derek, try to unlock this, please. Do it. So something in the area caught my attention. I can't explain what it is exactly, just that I know that it's this way. There's a cabin key. Unlock the cabin door. There's I just saw it. It's a it's a wraith. Spirit Essence, the Dreamer Rags, I don't know Deep Stalker Hide, and yeah, what's this? Spike Tower Shield. Uh, the shield that we had crafted, or sound is much better. Wat Waterlog Diary, <coughs> excuse me. A diary found in the Fallow Mire. One water-soaked entry dated 10 days ago is still legible. The damn roof leaks, and I've been eating boiled roots for a week. I'm squatting in a bog no one so much as spit on for ten years. Still better than the alienage. Thank Andraste. That's the last time I visit that for that city for a while. I'm worried about the gardeners. They weren't sick when I left, and now they're all down with a fever, and their little boy is at death's door. Nigel Marsh said we should lock them in their home, the sour codger. Maybe I can bring something to help. Is it death root that cures a fever or elf root? It can't be death root, can it? Ask Ira which is right. Death root will bring your death. Person that's uh, probably gone a little bit, uh, lost his mind. Okay, south. I just want to take a look outside. Blue vitriol. One down! Three of them. So let's go the way we're going. I'd like to avoid going through the water if we can. This is a little bit of an island, though. I don't know much I can do about it. I'm soaked to the bone, and I'm tired of it. Continue on. I fight the undead all day. Is this the last place to summon demons? Are we there already? Yeah, it would seem we are. We're quite close to uh, where the Inquisition soldiers are being held. At least this, from what the scouts have told us. Rough hide. 
There's a bunch of sacks here. I don't know why... Who's, like, venerating these areas? It's just odd. Oh. Pyro fight. Weird. Different materials to craft with this post. Examine. Veilfire and the Fallow Mire. These unreadable runes evoke for a moment a sudden and overpowering feeling of smug and vengeful triumph. As though a difficult problem has been solved, there is the image of a bottled elixir, then it fades. A cipher written in the last page of Apostate's Widris journal corresponds to the Veilfire writing found in the Fallow Mire. The deciphered messages are notes that, when taken together, form instructions on how to concoct a particularly dangerous poison. It's not really what we want so much as a cure to the plague. Okay, let's get ready. Demons are coming. They're coming this from this direction. On me. Cassandra! Or this is another one. I wasn't even targeting this one. Cassandra. These things are very tough. Get off of me. We need to kill these things. Damn it! Get its attention and boost on you. I need to take a potion. Get out of here. Ah. Get up, get up, Baron. Get up. Get up. Which one is more injured? I'm gonna give it a nice big lightning bolt. Oh, every time I hit them, the other one comes after me. We, uh, uh, Varric went down. No, oh, this one is not dead. Son of a... Let's take another potion. This one needs to die... Where is it? I think it actually just went down. Where's that lesser terror? It's had it. It's on the ground. I can't move. Come on, get out of the way. I need to use my lightning. Finally, the two terrors have gone down. Good work. We have a path free of corpses back to the shore. The fewer of these creatures, the better. Yeah, but it doesn't get what we came here for. We're still dealing with demons, but apparently the beyond, which is what we call the Fade, is uh, innumerable demons. They're just the ones that come through you have to deal with, but their, their numbers are without end. Varric, you're hurt, and I'm low on potions. I think we're going to have to... Oh, I don't want to have to do it, but we're going to have to return. We can't continue on, not... If we get into any dangerous combat again, we will all fall, and that's not something that uh, the world needs to have happen. What's that down there? Loot. Spirit essence. Okay, we're going to return to the camp. Wish that there was a closer camp. Don't have much of a choice, though. Okay. Let's, uh, we rested for another day. Let's return. Been through some tough fights to get where we're, we're trying to go. I wonder why I can't call him out. It's strange. Oh, how many times have I passed by this and not looted it? A chest. <laughs> mm 
Well, it's a bit of a, a run to get back. I'm really starting not to like this place. I come from a kind of like a, a place with uh, some swamps, but a lot of rivers, mostly forest. But uh, the problem is that this is like all swamp, all wet all the time, and I'm tired of being soaking wet. There's a whole area here we didn't even see before. Another Avar Bowman. Discovered Granite Point. Another region. Discovered. These are the stones, uh, the big stones that I saw from far off a video or two back. Yeah, I thought, yeah, th I thought there was some kind of of our old religious areas, like ruined monuments. Kind of looks like it is. It's leading me off somewhere, and I have no idea where this is going. Blue vitriol. This summer stone? Oh, it's more blue vitriol. We need these, though. This is this another grove type area? Oh, there's a, a very large bear over there. I don't want to ag aggravate it. Oh, there's a camp here. Uh, dead body. The bear has been munching on it or not. Two dead bodies. Note found at Dyer campsite. Uncle, I was hiding supplies above the rocks when I heard voices from the windmill to the west. It was the horn men again. There's more of them now. I have to see if anyone is still alive in the village. I'm sorry, but I swear I'll be careful. Lewis. This is the second mention of horn men. Oh, is that bear coming? 109 gold uh, from around Pommel. Wow. Went out with <laughs> burning blades of fire. Okay. That crossbow is remarkable, Varric. I am surprised the dwarves have not made more of them. The woman who made Bianca would rather that not happen. Wars are bloody enough as it is. A crossbow that fires this far and this quickly, with so little training, every battle would be a massacre. Indeed. I am surprised, not disappointed. chest. Uh, another staff. Not very good. We can sell it, though. Let's claim this region. For the Inquisition. Granite Point. Some statues in the Fallow Mire are of Avar origin. It amused Ban Hargrave to bring them back from her conquests in the hills and plant them outside her home, the way a gardener might transplant flowers. The Ban entertained visiting nobles by giving tours of the statues, regaling her guests with dark tales of Avar superstitions, which she mostly made up on the spot, except for Excerpt from Pursuit of Knowledge, The Travels of Chantry Scholar by Brother Genetivi. This man liked, writes a lot uh, about the, the land. Uh, dagger Grip, Longbow, and Shield. Take all. So this is completely off the beaten path, but where does it go? I'm not actually heading back, heading the way I wanted to. Oh. Daylight. A bit of it. It's kind of nice. Look at that. It's the first I've seen out here. It's usually just full of this uh, storm clouds. Like the place is cursed. Not just the plague, but the land is rebelling. Something has happened. Where is this? Anything? Hole, deep hole going down there. Maybe it's like a rabbit hole. Pinnacle. Okay, let's just go. This is not the way we came, so we can go out this way. It's a ladder. It goes up. Let's see the the moon. Actually, it's the moon, not the sunlight. 
Uh, just a little bit of things to sell. Nothing that important. Let's return from whence we came. Let's return down. I'm sure, sure that would get pretty irritating to all the time. Let's return whence we came. Oh, that hurt my feet. Ah, uh, my ankle's a little sore. Well, that's it for this direction. So we have to go back. Uh, maybe go back to the left. Just the, um, so there's a whole bunch of statues over here. Just seems brighter out now. What's over here? Looks like they're burning more corpses. Somebody was. Uh, oh. Walking corpse. Uh, I'll have to deal with it, I guess. Get this blue vitriol. Come on. Alright, let's go back. Now let's go back. We've explored this other area. Out of curiosity. We'll have to fight these Avar Bowmen. That was really easy. Lustrous cotton. Okay, so it's this way. Yeah. Lightning hitting everywhere. Lightning being shot by me as well. Creatures over there, this is like the third or fourth time we've gone this way. Uh, didn't quite make it that time. Okay, so now we go south. Try to bat bypass all the corpses. And anything else in the way. Okay, guys, let's continue on. Disengage. I know we're. So oh, 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 we cannot get past these guys. Oh, my God. Surrounded by corpses. Oh gosh. Just let, let me get my torch back. Okay, enough. Enough of that. Very close. Uh, let's get to this beacon, and then I'll end the video there. It does t go off in this direction, though. I don't know what's over there. Oops. Huh. 
Alright, so I guess I'll end the video here then. Thanks for watching guys, and we'll see you next time.